Welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. Welcome back to the channel. How are you all doing? I hope you are well. In today's video, we are going to complete this week's festival playlist, Autumn. And we're going to do the trial. We're going to get that done and we'll get the PR stunts done as well. I will redo the ones I've already done to show you the routes I took and the cars I used. We will get the playground games done as well and also the seasonal championships done at the same time Now, there's no need to do the online adventure again that carries over from when we completed that in summer so that's all good it also carries over to winter and spring as well so no need to do those four times because trying to complete that the first time was bad enough qualifying for 10 rounds and then qualifying for the online adventure was bad enough monthly rivals is already done as well with that at the beginning of summer so no need to do that again we just need to do the ones that are here so also the weekly challenges or daily challenges as it were um, they need to be done but I can't do those until they become available so three days 12 hours time so we're not gonna get 100% today but we are gonna get all of these done here which is always good so if you are new around here smash that subscribe button hit that like button and let's get on with the trial blistering speed okay first things first let's get on with the trial blistering speed Place first against unbeatable driver tires in a co-op championship. Not the best of situations, but let's just hope I'm put with a team that want to race and can race well. I've got to wait 2 minutes 50, but you guys do not, so I will see you in a second. Class S2, I'm going for my beautiful McLaren Senna. Tune will be available for download if you want it. Search for Gamertag, Skippy4631, or the file name Skippy YouTube. Here we go, one of my favourite racetracks on Forza Horizon 4, Hollywood Park, three laps, let's try and stay out of trouble here, got around them pretty swiftly, get around the Chiron, past the Hennessy, give me a bit of a love tap on the way past, it's fine, please don't do that, no, I'll let you go, go then, finally open the inside, good lad, good lad, what are we now? Place are we? Fourth. That's fine, that's good. Points mean prizes, and the points are good right now. Oh, a swift overtake. We move up into second place. Things are looking good. Boom! First place. I don't know how, but I've managed to stay out of trouble long enough to nab first place. I was in second going into the last lap, but the uh, the event door there. Had a few issues and I managed to sneak past. So it's a first place win for the first race, two to go. Here we go, race number two. Once again, let's just try and stay out of trouble. Starting last. Overtakes straight away. What is that driver's hard doing? Absolute retard. That wasn't a bad start at all. Another driver's hard getting a little bit fast and loose. Come on. Let's get past this guy. Dang's inside. It's going to be a crash here, I can see it. There isn't. Oh, up into second from last place. Boom! That is how we race, boys. And across the line, second place. That's fine by me. I went from last to second in about three corners. That was brilliant. 1,850 points to their 1,200. A 1, 2, 3 finish for the blue team. Here we go, race number three. I'm starting in second place. Yes, boys. Got a fighting chance to come in first now. Unless that Aventador catches me. This is Chiron up my bum, I can hear it. Trying to avoid the carnage. Is it going to be Sam? Here comes that event store. Here he comes. I'm going to let him through if he gets to me though. Because he is a lot quicker. I'm better in the corners, but on the straights he mullers me. I absolutely flew this track. I'm, they're nowhere near me. I'm absolutely gone. If you check out the map, first place. I They're not even finished yet. There we go. Cross the line. I was. I flew! That's 1,850 points to 1,200. That is three races out of three. That is brilliant. That means that is done. One off-road. Off-road? One online challenge complete. There we go. Blistering speed complete. Super wheel spin unlocked. So there we go, guys. The trial has now gone gold. Blistering speed is complete. Let's move on to Seasonal Playground Games Autumn Games Series 7. Here we go then. Autumn Games Series 7 Extreme Off Road Class A. Two minutes to the next event. So I'm going to go ahead and search that and I will see you all in a second. Here we go. Round one. A bit of Team King. 
Now, it all depends on how good your team is, but you do need to win this. I'm in the T100 Baja truck. The tune will be available for download if you want to go and grab that. Round one is done. Team Red get one point. Team Red wins. That means Team Red gets another point. 2-0. I'm on the winning team, by the way. Nice little game of Infected. I will be honest, there is only three on the enemy team, and there's five of us. So it's 5v3. A little bit unfair, but... A win's a win, and if it gets this done, then I'm happy. Boom, red team gets another point. Admittedly, again, 1v5, but his team left. A bit unfortunate for him, so red team wins. Red team championship winners. That should mean this is done, I hope. Autumn Game Series 7 is complete. Place first at the end of the championship. Boom. Epic cowboy hat unlocked. So there we go guys, Autumn Games Series 7 has gone gold, thank god for that. Admittedly the whole enemy team left by round 4, so we won by default which is nice. So it made it nice and quick and nice and easy for me. So I've already done the PR stunts, or two of them. I'm going to redo them just to show you my route, what I did, how I did it, in what car. So let's crack on with the leap of faith. Now for this PR stunt I think we're looking for around 425-426 feet. To get this completed. I've done 513, seasonal objective is already complete but I'm going to do it again to show you the route I took. The objective here is to jump over the church. Now what makes this especially difficult are these trees here, these bushes, because you can't see the jump when you're coming up to it. So I do this, I line up with the jump, I reverse back, you're going to hit the wall so you want to go this way a little bit and in the opposite field there's a tree in the corner. Just here. I line up with that and then I go from here basically and absolutely punch it in my BMW i8 obviously. Well, what else would you jump? Head for this little bush on the left. There we go. And you should quite easily 493.25 feet. Easy peasy. Job done. Seasonal PR stunt danger jump sign thing complete. Now, with the Leap of Faith completed, that is now gold in the BMW i8. Let's move on to Strathbridge Speed Zone. For this speed zone, I use the McLaren P1 because it's got huge downforce and a huge amount of speed. Okay, the speed we're looking for, I believe, if I remember correctly, is 140 miles an hour. I could be slightly wrong on that. It could be like 142, 145, but around 140 mile an hour mark should be good. I've already done it at 146.5, so let's go ahead and get this done. Here we go then boys, coming in from a westerly direction. Enter the speed zone with a nice lot of speed, as much as you can. And you lost it there. Keep the speed up. There we go, 146.71, a new personal best. Nice and easy, that should be your seasonal PR stunt complete. So there we go, Strathbridge is complete. As you saw, my run wasn't the cleanest and it wasn't the quickest. I could have been slightly quicker, but it got it done, it got it complete, so there we go. So with that complete, let's move on to the PR stunt back lane, which is a drifting event, and we need 46,000 points for that all-important gold. Now, my weapon of choice for this is the Nissan 240SX. I was going to go with the Dodge Viper SRT10, but it's a little bit OP, and I don't really want to do that, so we'll go with the 240. Here we go boys, 46,000 points, easy peasy I hope, there we go, we're already at 30, 40, boom, done, nice and easy, and beat my personal best, nice, 61,000 points. I didn't tune this car, it was already tuned for me, it's straight out the box, as it is. Nice and easy, nice and quick. So there we go, back lane is now gone gold, 46,000 points. I scored 61,000 just to rub it in a little bit. Let's move on to the seasonal championships. We'll just do these in order. I'm going to go with the first one, don't need roads. For these championships, you do need to win them. You can't just take part, you do need to win. So I'm going with my bowler ER, EXRS even. To make this a little bit easier, I'm sticking them on expert driver tires. Why I can make it harder than it needs to be, so all we have to be on is expert drag tires. Here we go then, race number one in the bowler. EXRS. I said it right that time. Oh, why are you braking? It's a straight line, buddy. I'll push you along. Haha. <laughs> and across the line, first place. 
And across the line, first place, race number two in the bag. And across the line, first place in the bag, third and final race done, that is this championship wrapped up. Don't need roads, completed, got an achievement as well, automobiles. There we go guys, one seasonal championship has gone gold, on to the next one. Let's move on to all fall down. Here we go then, a solo championship, all fall down. Again, expert driver tires, that's all we need, why make it harder than it needs to be. We've got some good old classic rally, I've got a fair few of these, but none of these are really tuned i'm not sure what that is but we're going to go with the mini cooper s because i know it's quite good so we're going to run with that once again with these seasonal championships you do need to win not just take part so do your best to win it all the cars you see in this video will be up for download if you want to go grab their tunes it's file name is skippy youtube or my gamer tag skippy4631 and across the line race number one in the bag good little mini and across the line race number two complete and across the line, third and final race in the bag, that is this championship complete. With all fall down, now gone gold, let's move on to Rail Yard Rumble. This is quite cool because the reward for this is the Citroen DS3 Racing. And I've seen quite a few comments on YouTube, I've had quite a few comments on YouTube on how to unlock this car. They've now made it a seasonal championship reward, which makes it a little bit easier to complete. Because I believe before it was an online event that we had to do to get this car. So that's pretty cool that we're going to get this. So let's go ahead and get this seasonal championship wrapped up. For this championship, my weapon of choice is going to be my 205 Turbo 16 Forza Edition. And across the line, race number one in the bag. Done. First place. Race number two complete. Came second place. 205 probably isn't the best choice of car for this championship, I'm going to be honest. But I'm going to, I'm going to muddle through because we're still in first place with 36 points. So we'll be fine. Here we go, third and final race of this championship. I've switched up to the Ford Fiesta Hoonigan edition purely because the 205 struggled way too much. I just couldn't, like things like this, it just couldn't do it. It was too low, it was on race tyres. It was just rubbish, so let's get this done in the Fiesta. I'll see you at the end of the race. And across the line, race number three complete. You will not know how many times I restarted that race purely because rewind wouldn't work, it glitched out, I kept crashing, I missed checkpoints, just absolutely horrible. The Ford Fiesta, even that struggled slightly over the lumps and bumps and big jumps, but we got it done, I got first place, that should be this championship all wrapped up and complete. There we go, Rail Yard Rumble is done, first, second, third complete, expert driver tires done. And the Citroen DS3 Racing is mine. So there we go, 96% of this season is complete. I have done pretty much everything on gold apart from the daily challenges, which I have to wait for them to unlock. So I think by Wednesday they will be unlocked and then I can go ahead and get the 100% complete and unlock that all-important Pontiac GTO 65. So there we go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you are new around here, smash that subscribe button, hit that like button and have an awesome day.